Hi, I'm Paul Richardson. Welcome back to the 14th episode on Pistol Shield. And last week we looked at uh, single-handed with your strong hand. This week we're going to look at single-handed with your support and your weak hand. There's a couple of things that we need to look at this. Uh, there's a couple of issues that we need to get over, such as how we pick up the sights, etc. Let's have a look at it. So, support hand shooting. It's always alien to us because it's not something that we tend to do. Things we need to look at, same thing again, make sure we're not upright with this. You've got to lean into it as much as you can. The reason why you've got to lean into it is to get as much support, much aggression behind the actual recoil impulses as they go through. Now what you'll find with this particular technique is you actually shooting is, is very good. That is usually because you're just concentrating more. I mean, we go back to the first episode when we looked at uh, shooting and mental preparation and the fact that we need to be concentrating on what we're doing. What you find is when you're shooting with your, with your support and you do tend to get good, good groups, it's not as fast, your trigger squeeze isn't, isn't as good. But let's have a look at that now. Make sure our thumbs again don't claw down. It's not as vitally important unless you've got a dual magazine release on the other side. So we're down. What you've got to do is make sure that as we're bringing it, we've got to tilt those those sights slightly just so I can pick up with my dominant eye, which is my right eye. Obviously, if you are left eye dominant but right-handed and you're then pushing out with your support hand, you can actually pick up with your dominant eye straight away. You don't have to tilt those sights. It's depending on what dominant eye you are. So let's look at it again. So here we're in the CQB stance, it's forward, straight into it, bend out, slight tilt, just so I can pick up there on my right hand side. And if I need it, remember that technique we discussed a few episodes back, if I need to, just a quick wink with there, and that will make sure that my support, uh, my, my dominant eye will pick up those that front foresight as quick as we can. Okay, so that is uh, single-handed, weak hand firing, remember, our actual uh, uh, strong hand that we've got with this won't be on our chest. We discussed this last week for those obvious reasons. If, if for whatever reason we've got this free, it would be on the weapon. We'd be firing it the other hand. Something's with this. For whatever reason, like see we've got our VIP down, we've got uh, a door open. Whatever the reason being is we can't use this. So we're not going to put it on our chest and support ourselves in the way that uh, uh, competition shooters do. Okay. So the salient point, down from the midriff, straight in. Tilt that weapon slightly so we can pick up with our dominant eye. Make sure our thumb's down and make sure we have that same smooth progressive squeeze. Thanks for watching. Next week we're going to be discussing shooting on a move and how we look at that. See you next week.